information tonight on the lawsuit filed by families in the eastern Sandusky County Cancer Cluster. They are suing the Whirlpool Corporation for alleged dumping of toxins that they say caused the cancer cases. Tim Miller is live in Fremont where the whole community can ask questions tonight at a forum. Tim? Yeah, that's right, Emily. A town hall meeting will begin in one hour at 7 o'clock tonight here at Fremont Ross High School, and they are expecting a number of people from Clyde and the surrounding area. Now, the attorneys who filed the lawsuit on behalf of the families two weeks ago say they have been fielding a lot of phone calls from the public, questions about recent testing, which families claim revealed a toxic chemical in their attics called benzaldehyde. They believe it was put into the air by Whirlpool during their manufacturing process, and they say it likely caused the cancer that has claimed three children's lives and has sickened many others. Now, the attorneys say others have also come forward recently saying they also have cancer. They wonder if they are somehow connected. Uh, we're getting calls from people that have cancer, um, that are afraid every day that their children are going to develop cancer. Um, so people have a lot of questions and we think this is the opportunity to give them the information. Now, in addition to a question and answer session here tonight, there will also be information about that testing in the attics and what people can do to clean their attics if they are concerned. Representatives from Whirlpool have told us there is no scientific evidence the company is responsible for causing these cancer cases. Live tonight in Fremont, I'm Tim Miller.